act. Well, on this date last year, police chief Fred Fletcher was sworn into office. The head of the Chattanooga Police Department had to deal with gang violence on his first day, and a year later, a similar situation unfolds. News Channel 9's Drew Balea sat down with the chief to discuss the last 12 months. Drew. That's right, Alyssa. There have been ups and downs over the last 12 months. Today, I talked with Chief Fletcher about the gang culture in Chattanooga, what's being done, where the department is heading in the next year, and his reaction to this past year. We have every officer on the street and investigations out actively looking for these folks. Today, Chattanooga Police Chief Fred Fletcher is busy working on the city's most recent act of gang violence. I'm working with our intelligence unit today to put out some rewards for tips from the community to make sure that we approach this investigation from every angle. Yesterday, two children were hurt as a result of the gang-related shooting. Fletcher says while property crimes are down by 8% and total violence down 3.6%, gang violence remains front of mind. When a crime occurs to you or your family, it's important to us. He says that's why they are reworking their mission and values from the top down. Uh, reforming the way we select, hire, recruit, and promote people. Earlier this month, Chief Fletcher outlined his vision of the force to counsel, saying that he wanted to diversify the department. Right now, only a quarter of the officers are African American. Different people also bring different skills, and it just makes good sense to have a wide variety of people, ideas, and skills to serve our customers. In the past year, he's also launched the Community Immersion Program. To show a different way of teaching prospective police officers how to value and appreciate their community. While building relationships with the community has been a focus of the last 12 months, cracking down on gang violence, a main goal. Chief Fletcher says the arrest of Cortez Sims is a highlight so far. How many times I can take a violent offender that, if, that harms our community, and saves other people's lives, um, that's absolutely rewarding. While gang violence is down in the city, gang members and activity still thrives, leaving what Fletcher says is more work to do. We're very, very satisfied with the progress we've made, but we're not content to rest on the progress we've made. Now, Fletcher also tells me that his focus moving forward for the next 12 months includes initiatives to address domestic violence and special victims. Alyssa? Drew, thank you.